hello guys welcome back to my channel so in this video we are going to see how we can uh, tap on any element and how we can make use of gesture to perform certain actions so do watch my video from start to end so that you are having a good understanding about how gestures can work so if we go here and we search for touch actions apm there are lot of actions which are provided like uh, press and move to and then there are some multi actions and uh, also there is like scrolling and swiping so uh, we can create like uh, the object of the touch action class and uh, then we can call all the methods which are there like uh, press move to release and perform these are like a kind of gestures which we will be needing while we are automating our application so now if uh, i want to click on any of these element using touch actions then we can just create the object of that class and then we can click on it so there are two ways one is by the coordinate like we can find the coordinate of any particular element and we can click on it and the other type is by element reference so we can refer any element where we want to click and then we can perform the tapping so let us go to our IntelliJ and I will create a new class here and I will name it as uh, maybe tapping gesture now what I will do I will just copy these two lines and I will paste it here okay let me create a main method for this first and I will copy it here okay now I will add the exception so in order to create a touch action class we can just write T O U C H action so there you can see two options one is for uh, APM and another is for selenium so if we are automating anything on web application or hybrid application we need to use touch actions from selenium interactions otherwise if we are automating and performing tapping or any other gesture on native app then we need to use touch action from APM Java client so I will just name it as uh, tap or maybe I will just name it as action equals to new touch action and here I think I need to pass the driver reference so yeah now what I will do I will use this action object that has been created and I will call the methods so we can see like there are a lot of methods like tap press release move to long press and long press uh, options then there is wait action wait so, uh, th these are like we can utilize these to perform the gestures and we can work on automating our application native application so what i am going to do i am just going to what i will do i will just create uh, before going here i will just create uh, the element locator strategy for which i want to click so say for example i want to click on content what i will do i will just create the locator strategy by so I want to click on content I will just write content so here is the content uh, locator content element and uh, I will be clicking it by mobile by dot 
so maybe we can just there are different ways how we can click we have already seen about android ui automator so you can just go through my videos and see like how android ui automator works so we are just going to click it using accessibility id and then the accessibility id of this will be content now we are going to create the touch action object and after that we are going to call the method action dot perform tab press long press and long press so here what we want to do we want to tap right so we are just going to select the tap options and uh, if we go here so here you can see tap options is taking tap options tap options type right so with this what we can do we can just click on tap options dot tap options and then we are going to so here there are different ways how we want to tap like with elements with tap count with positions and like uh, with position means like we want to use the coordinates a lot not so right now i just want to go with the element so i will just so see here this element option is taking element option element so i'm just going to select this and now element option element is also uh, going to perform tap based on the element and maybe it is also going to it can also work with the coordinates in x and int y and it can also work with the offset so currently i am just going to work with the element so i am just going to select this and here i want to type the element which i want to use in order to perform the click so i will just write driver dot find element by and here i will pass this element and now after doing this thing i want to what i want to do i want to perform some actions right or uh, you can actually chain the elements if you want like you want to perform multiple touch actions uh, and long press so you can change this so this is the usp of touch actions you can chain multiple gestures in one go to utilize any i mean to to achieve any particular automation task but currently i just want to perform so i will just click on perform and here now let us see if uh, this is working fine or not so i will just go here and i will check my server is running and uh, i will just run it So there are multiple ways how you can achieve touch uh, actions and uh, this is one of the way but maybe we will also look into the other aspects and we will try to create a video on that so you see like uh, we were able to achieve the tapping from this content so it tapped on content and it opened this page so hope you like my video do subscribe to my channel and do let me know whatever uh, problem you are facing in apm or maybe in mobile automation i would like to help you guys and if you want me to create any particular video do let me know i will try to make a video on that so do subscribe to my channel thank you